broadcast and the warning alarm will vary at any given location. This variability, normally more noticeable at greater distances from the transmitter, can occur even though you are using a good quality receiver in good working order. The warning alarm will be activated for hazardous watches and warnings. For station WMG 538, broadcasting near Lindell, on a frequency of 162.45 MHz, the warning alarm will be activated for the following counties in North Carolina, Alexander, Avery, Burke, Caldwell, Catawba, McDowell, Mitchell, Rutherford, Watonga, Wilkes, and Yancey. This concludes the NOAA Weather Radio, all hazards torn alert test. I think you got a little bit too many weather radios on, my friend. Good God. Now the service forecast for the northern foothill. And Blacksburg will not be testing until next week, so. or other emergencies. Special build receivers are automatically activated to warn of the impending hazard. Tests of these receivers are normally conducted by the National Weather Service every Wednesday between 11 a.m. and noon. Reception of this program and the warning alarm will vary at any given location. The variability becomes more noticeable at greater distances from the transmitter. Well, I recognize the warning. To provide the most consistent warning service possible, the warning alarm will be activated for warnings selected watches and other environmental emergencies affecting the following North Carolina counties. Alamance, Alexander, Allegheny, Anson, Berkey, Cabarrus, Caswell, Chatham, Davidson, Davie, Durham, Edgecombe, Forsyth, Franklin, Granville, Green, Gilbert, Halifax, for the following counties in South Carolina, Chesterfield and Marlboro, and the following counties in Virginia, Brunswick, Carroll, Grayson, Henry, Mecklenburg, Patrick, and Pittsylvania. This includes the independent cities of Galax, Martinsville, and Danville. Repeating, the National Weather Service has just activated the public warning alarm tolling in the test of the weather radio's one alarm system. Piedmont Triad Airport, it was cloudy. The temperature was 81 degrees, the dew point 74, and the relative humidity 79%. The wind was southwest at 10 miles an hour. The pressure was 30.07 inches and in rising. At Winston-Salem, it was mostly sunny. The temperature was 81 degrees, the dew point 73, and the relative humidity 78%. The wind was southwest at 8 miles an hour. Oh, still on. The pressure was 30.09 inches and rising. Elsewhere across the region this hour, at Asheville, it was sunny with a temperature of 80. In Jefferson, it was cloudy with a temperature of 73. At Mount Mary, it was cloudy with a temperature of 74. At Charlotte, it was partly sunny with a temperature of 85. With a temperature of 83. At Danville, it was cloudy with a temperature of 78. In Wilmington, it was hardly sunny with a temperature of 84. At Wilmington, it was mostly sunny with a temperature of 88. Where? Portions of Southwest Virginia and Southeast West Virginia, including the following counties in Southwest Virginia, Bland, Giles, Hulusty, and Caswell. In Southeast West Virginia, Mercer. Until 12 15 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Flooding of rivers, creeks, streams, and other low lying and flood prone locations is imminent for occurring. Additional details at 9 08 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. The public reported heavy rain in the Warren area due to thunderstorms. Flooding is already occurring. Between 1.5 and 2.5 inches of rain have fallen. Some locations that will experience flooding include. Bluefield, Bastion, Rocky Head, Pocahontas, 
provide the most consistent and dependable warning service possible, the warning alarm will be activated for hazardous watches and warnings for the following counties in the Blacksburg County Warning Area in North Carolina, Allegheny, Ash, Watauga, and Wilkes. In Virginia, Grayson. In addition, we broadcast short-fused products for the following counties in Virginia, Washington. In North Carolina, Alexander, Avery, Caldwell, Catawba, Davie, Iredell, Surrey, and Yadkin. And in Tennessee, Johnson. This has been a test of the North Weather Radio warning device. We now return to normal programming. So 56. Sounds like it. Why are you saying act now to protect your life? <laughs> 